What's up guys, it's Visual Waste and I'm back with another paint unboxing. It's been a minute from the last one, but trust me you're going to love this. Alright, okay, we've got the paint here. We've got two boxes from Graph City. It's in and around 400 quid's worth of paint. So without further ado, let's snap to it. Trust you guys. Start with the wee one first. See what this is. So I've completely ran short of everything, like my caps, my filters from the mask. I have a couple of big jobs on that involve quite a lot of color. So first up, we've got some gray dots. Love these gray dots. Although they clog like crazy, so you gotta shake the can off something serious. But these bad boys get you a really nice fine line. See it there. Okay. What are these? We got the black dots as well. Again, nice fine lines. Nice. Some ebony gloves. So these gloves are are they talc free? Latex free. Um, powder free as well. So there's nothing inside them. Give me a look at these. So the ebony ones, I like them because they have a wee bit of extra room at the bottom here to go sort of up on your wrist. So some gloves don't don't go the whole way, but I prefer them to go right down, you know, so you can so you don't get like a lovely line along your wrist of paint. Quite tight fitting. I've got these in a size. Uh, I think these are medium. So. They are quite tight. I'd probably recommend doing a large if you've quite large hands. Okay, so that's them. New filters. So the mask I use is the Cobra mask. It's quite low profile and the thing I like about it is you can pop all this out and you can give this green bit a wash with some water. Because if you're carrying it around in your paint, um, you can get you still get some dust and stuff inside it and it can get quite dusty and gacked up but if you can give it a good scrub you can take out all the, all the hardware this pops off so everything comes completely off which is what I like about it so you can buy the filters from Graph City as well quite tidy wee filters but the first time I used this mask I, I left this on and about halfway through a mural, I couldn't understand why I was about to pass out. These are just covers for if you're traveling with them or you're leaving them and you're not using it. So if you leave these on, you'll find it quite hard to breathe. Okay, safety first as well. So that's in. Another box of filters. Okay, we've got a wee bit of paint here. So you'll see by this order, I have actually made a change in my normal purchase instead and went for a ton of gold. So reasons why I've done this is you cannot beat the colours in these. This is heavy pigmented paint so the colours are really really nice and um, far superior to the likes of the 94 range. Um, I just prefer using them. I've been using them now for about from the start of the year, really. And I prefer. I definitely prefer them. So that's all. It's a really nice red that there. It's actually called brick. So I think I'm doing is uh, there's a wee bit of brick in it. I've got some grey stuff in here. I'll be a grass city pen. City lanyard, we bag of cups. The other thing as well with the gold is I prefer the stop cap that comes on the gold. It's it's a nice sort of in between medium line. Okay, so they're all break. Got an absolute ton of stickers, some kind of offers or something. Some stickers. 
quite a good wee selection of stickers here actually. We've got the 94, Lotana. We've got Flame Paint, Hardcore Range, Motocons, Flame, Flame. Some frontline stuff there. A nice shiny Crank sticker. Graph City stickers. Oh, well, that's quite cool, isn't it? Crank, crank marker. Hello, my name is, and Mr. Serious as well. Very nice. So yeah, the paint was, there's more Hello My Name, every colour in Hello My Name is. The paint came to £392, and because I went over a certain threshold, I got discount on the shipping then. The shipping was actually free from the UK to Northern Ireland. I also earned myself £9 in loyalty vouchers as well, for the, that'll come off the next order then. Nothing else there. A nice little style file as well. The green one, I think I have nearly all of them at the minute. Um, there's some good stuff there. It's one of the things I love about Graph City is the time that it, the, the, it's the time that they take to put in stickers and magazines. And, you know, not all companies do that. So now I want to the absolutely massive box. This thing is 30, 34 kilograms of paint. And some really nice colors in this. They need to be nice. Okay, so that one's a wood stuff. Okay. So, let's have a look at this one. Some of the Terra, it's like a nice mustardy color. You can see that. And then the hot chocolate as well. Yellow submarine. So I've got two of each on there. Okay. You can even see by those donuts there, you know that. It's just gonna, you know it's just gonna look good. Spread. Some pebble, it's almost like white, but it's a nice off white. And then that, some of that linden green. Nice. I've got a lot of greys in this order, too. I've got wall. Iron curtain, which is like the next step up. So if you go with your pebble, it would kind of be the lightest, would it? No marble, I think, is a wee bit lighter. No pebble is. So pebble, marble, wall, iron curtain would be sort of the steps going, you know, down. I think I have some of the darker shades as well in here somewhere. So you're probably wondering, like, where I've been the past week. Well, I've been busy. Look 
looking forward to painting these. I would usually like stuff as well. Usually do portraits with this with the greys. You know, I've done a portrait portrait recently um, using the Montana gold stuff, and it just looks far better looking than the '94 greys. So I made the change. It's a wee bit more expensive than the '94. But you get what you pay for, you know. So got some Venice there and the it's a very, very pale kind of green. And some cool candy. Cool candy and another Venice, so they're all the same. Seven more boxes and cutting this one. and then the darker stuff for some of the details and then you can see some of the lighter stuff. So it's quite a, a very colored piece but it's all the majority of it's green. And um, it's gonna be like a it's, it's a drinks brand uh, and it's their logo is an owl. So the owl has been kind of done up artwork ways and um, digitally and it's quite you know green. It's not not the proper colours of an owl. We've got olive green. It's real nice that colour. Again. That's some of the sweet dreams, purples. This should all be the same sweet dreams. story there was one time I was working um, and I called I was out on a job in city centre and I called our local paint supply shop which is closed now and um, it was shop green and I was on the phone to the guy working in the shop and I was like what is like for green man and just as I said that this lady passed me and sort of looked at me like what is he talking about it was just about spread paint it? so Got some of that light venom. Um, that one was linden green. So I think I've nearly got every shade of green possible going on here. And this is another box which isn't taped. So 
and it'll all be the same color. And guess what? It's green. More of that smaragd green. It's pretty sweet. So, that is all of it. So just before you turn the video off, uh, what I do is I link below, right? So down below, I'll have a link to Graph City. Now, if you click that link and you make a purchase, a small amount of money comes back to this channel. And then I put that money into making videos. So it's your way of supporting the channel by using the affiliate link to Graph City.